The RWA Professional Practices and Responsibilities course gives you vital knowledge to operate safely, confidently and legally in your work as a professional skipper or crew. It was introduced following calls from the industry for a better understanding of the regulations and laws governing what we do and is primarily aimed at those working on board any boat that is subject to the MCA Code of Practice. Given the international origin of the national shipping regulations, much of the material is applicable to all commercial operators. It doesn't matter whether you drive a rib, captain a super yacht, skipper a charter yacht or a work boat, this course will make you more aware of your responsibilities and explain your duty of care. It is important to remember that the same rules apply to all of those people. The PPR course starts with four training modules. The first module, Commercial Environment, gives you an overview of the commercial maritime world and how you fit into it. Next, the People module looks in detail at the regulations and how they apply to the people on board. The Vessel module, as you would expect, focuses on vessel requirements. The final module, Purpose, draws everything together in real life scenarios. Those real life scenarios are an important aspect of the PPR course and will help you get to grips with the various regulations you need to comply with. Instead of teaching you rules by rote, the course will take you step by step through scenarios to help you work out whether you can legally do what you've been asked to do, whether the crew have the right qualifications for the job and whether the boat is certified appropriately. Throughout the course you are directed towards live resources and reference materials helping you learn your way around the documents that will give you the answers to those questions. These are the same documents you will need to refer to in your work at sea. Following the training modules, you get a chance to put your knowledge into practice with the practice assessment before moving on to the final assessment. Both the practice and the final assessment are broken down into two sections. The first section tests your knowledge of the rules and regulations. The second section asks you to research answers to realistic scenarios reinforcing the idea that it's more important for you to understand how to find the answer rather than learning intricate legal details off by heart. When you have passed the final assessment you can download a certificate that can be used to support your application for commercial endorsement to your RWA Certificate of Competence. Although you can complete the course online, your chosen training centre will provide an instructor and technical support to help you through the course. You can find a list of training centres offering this course on our website.